What is going on guys? My name is Cliff and today we are going to be talking about something that you are doing right now. YouTube. Being on YouTube and what it's all about. But before we get started with that, as always, we gotta talk about the gameplay. So in the background you are watching a 50 gun streak solo on the map Detroit, and interestingly enough, I know the map this time versus my last commentary where I had no idea what the map was on because I'm a complete idiot. And he is using the BAL 27, and the player himself is Rezzy, so be sure to go check him out. He's a pretty good player, if I do say so myself. I mean, he's probably not as good as me, you know. I get like a three or four gun streak every single game, so. He's got to step up his game to get up to my level, and also my link will be down there below. Uh, nobody cares about my link. Don't go click on it or anything. But that is the gameplay you will be watching, so now let's get into the topic of today's video. As I've said before, we are going to be talking about YouTube, and I think personally that YouTube is the best company in the world. Now you might be thinking, YouTube isn't a company, it's just a website where people post videos and watch videos. But it is. It is a very sophisticated logistics, other big words that I can't think of right now, business, that it it just, I think it's personally amazing. Now the thing is, you post videos and then that can connect you to people all over the world. Anywhere in the world people can watch your video unless of course they're in some place where the emperor or leader is like, no, you can't have internet or you can't be on YouTube and stuff because they have, there's places like that where the emperor and leaders are stupid because some places aren't as cool as the US of A and maybe Canada if you're watching this from Canada or Europe or something, I don't know. But USA is the best country in the world with the land of free democracy and shit and guns and pancakes and waffles and stuff. Now, I'm getting a little carried away here with how great the USA is. Now, also with YouTube, it allows, it allows us to share our thoughts, feelings, and memories, and we can save them. You don't even have to upload them to the public. You can upload them as unlisted, and then later, years later even, you can show them to your family. So that it's just like an unlimited storage place where you can then show future generations what living life as a kid was all about for you, or living with your family, or amazing memories you had maybe at a camp or anything at all and not only that but doing YouTube um, I think personally has it has allowed me to meet people I would have never met otherwise I mean without doing YouTube I would have never heard of Hydra I would just be watching those funny um, funny videos that have 10 billion views and stuff and that's all I'd probably be doing on YouTube but I just enjoy making videos I enjoy watching videos. I think that I've just met so many cool people and that's just a fabulous experience, you know, getting to know people from all around the world, getting to have exposure to other cultures. And it also gives you some good communication skills as in I was not a good speaker and I probably am still not a very good speaker. When, I mean, before I started YouTube and stuff, and I do believe that my skills have improved. Maybe they're not perfect, and you might not think they're perfect, but they have improved. I mean, in school even, I still don't like getting up and talking in front of the class to do a presentation. It's just one of the worst experiences in the world for me, but it's getting easier by doing YouTube, and I think that's just amazing that the experience from YouTube is helping me with real life, and even though technically I guess it does correspond to real life, but I think it's just amazing that YouTube is doing that for me personally. And I bet for you too. I mean, you would have never had any reason to know me if you weren't on YouTube or I weren't on YouTube. So that's pretty cool too. I mean, I get to know you a little bit, man. I bet you're a pretty lame person. I'm just kidding, you. but you are pretty lame, I'm guessing. You're a loser. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Jokester, jokester, not really. I'm pretty serious, you're a loser. I'm just joking. But along with that, it's, for me and other YouTube video makers, we get a bunch of experience in the field of making videos and this is really good for future use because you can put it on a resume or something and I think that is just fabulous as in like you can put in that you know how to edit videos, you know how to make thumbnails. Not only that, but if you're, if you're a little bit bigger, you can explain how you marketed your channel because I have to get my channel out there since I'm not that big to other people so that they know I exist at all and that is difficult and I'm not saying go on to other people's channels, bigger channels and comment on their videos saying come check me out, I have amazing videos and stuff like that because that's not how you do it. 
you got to go to maybe YouTube forums, tell your friends, ask your friends to tell friends, ask your subscribers or viewers to subscribe, and then tell their own friends. It's just like a giant thing of marketing and along with that business. I mean, it gives you a lot of business skills that you can use later in life or right now in life. And I think that it's very unique that you, YouTube allows you to develop these skills. And I think that is just... It's just amazing that YouTube has allowed people to have so many opportunities and expose them to all these new gifts and skills that they can use. I mean, I, I know I've probably said it like five times, but it's just amazing. YouTube is amazing. And you may not think that, but I think that YouTube really changes people's lives for the better. I mean, I think White Boy 7th Street said himself, YouTube saved his life. I mean, I personally do not watch White Boy 7th Street, but I did, I mean, I have seen a few videos and one of them, he was explaining how YouTube saved his life because he was going to commit suicide and kill himself or something. I do not know the exact scenario, but I do know that he had ruined his life through drugs or something and YouTube helped him get out of that and I think for him, that is amazing again. I know I've said amazing maybe a million times in this video, but I think that if it happened to White Boy 7th Street, then it happened to so many other people too. And I mean, YouTube, if YouTube saves lives, why isn't it incredible? And so I think that's really it. Uh, I think there's no other reason why I have to explain that about YouTube. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry I ended on a little bit of a sad note there with White Boy 7th Street, but I think it is still cool about how amazing, amazing, I've pro I think I should go back and count how many times I've said amazing in this video. It's probably about a billion, bajillion, kalillion. And so until next time, I will see you guys later. So I hope you have a great day, a great week, a great month, a great year, and a great lifetime. So always do something nice for somebody. Always have a great time. Do the stuff you enjoy. And I will see you all later. Thank <laughs> you.